The Lessons of History by Will and Ariel Durant. This is a classic book. Uh, history is great to read. Like in the evening you can read it and it helps you fall asleep. It's great to learn from the lessons of history because history does repeat itself. But they say that only like in the outlines and not like yeah, here's the uh, what they say history repeats itself but only in the outline and in the large. So there's something to learn though from history like for example this corona pandemic that's still going on right now. Uh, it's interesting that every exactly pretty much exactly every 100 years there was a uh, like a disease that spread uh, that became a pandemic and killed a lot of people and it's mysterious how it was like just exactly 100 years ago like uh, Spanish flu was 100 years before this and then there was I think the um, what was the Black Death? What was it called? Uh, that that was I think 100 years before that. But anyways, this book is not about that. But yeah, they this book, um, this video is a review of this book, and I highly recommend it, of course. And this book is from uh, Will and Ariel. Will and Ariel Durant. They wrote this uh, much bigger book that I haven't actually read yet. I would want to, which is called the Story of Civilization. And that's like the really like in detail, um, re really like big book about history. And they won a Nobel Prize for that book. And this book is like a um, summary of that pretty much. They made like a very short book so that like more people can benefit from those lessons. And this is a very good book. Like uh, also like Ray Dalio recommend reading this book. I think it's like one of his most recom one of the books that he most recommends. And um, I'm not going to like go through all of the lessons of history, but I could say like a couple of first ones that I like it. Uh, first lesson of history is that life is competition. They say uh, that's like very true. Like of course, like every like kind of like resources, that it's competition. Like ever science, like in the big uh, in the uh, in the past, of course, humans like competed for like food and like mates and still today of course we compete for like uh, money like resources uh, in business we compete ag compete against like other business businesses to uh, or business owners to earn that money and still of course like a competition over mates and everything so life is competition then the second lesson is also that life is selection here's uh, like a great line from the book that I underlined uh, science nature here meaning total reality and its processes has not read very carefully the American Declaration of Independence or the French Revolutionary Declaration of the Rights of Man. We are all born, born unfree and unequal, uh, subject to our physical and psychological heredity and to the customs and traditions of our group, diversity, diversely endowed in health and strength, in mental capacity and qualities in character. So nature really like selects only like the strongest and the uh, most like adaptable and those <coughs> uh, those individuals who really like can survive like it's, it's selection it doesn't it's not equal to all so yeah I, I highly recommend picking up this book here's my quick review of it I have linked it right uh, below this video if you want to order it for yourself. So check that link out. Also, if you want to uh, start reading more books below that, there's also a list of my top 10 favorite books. So you can order through those links, their affiliate links, uh, and that way you can help this channel as well. It's no additional cost, just a normal price, only that the bookstore, bookdepositor.com, will pay me a small commission, which will help me to do more videos on this channel. So thanks so much for watching this video. Uh, like and subscribe. I'll see you in the next one.